It's a very important day. The REACH Center does a lot of amazing collaborative work and really meets the unmet needs of our neighbors. So with more than 34 partners, we utilize a space to work with individuals that come in that are dealing with housing instability, maybe need some access to health care, financial instability, and just need to be connected to resources. And so with our 34 partners that come in and table and utilize this, the building to meet with individuals, they're able to get connected to the services that will meet their self-identified needs. We're able to provide for basic needs. We have a very, very small food pantry, but we also have hygiene products and other items available to help folks kind of get one stop place where folks can come. That is a huge difference with limited time, limited access to resources. If you have to walk or if you're using the bus system and being able to get to multiple places to get your needs met, that's daunting and overwhelming. So be, to be able to come into a space that you're comfortable and connect with multiple resources and kind of get you, get you connected to the assistance you need, is important and so that was really one of the things that we wanted to do was provide a one-stop place where people could walk in feel welcome and get their yeah, so the, the report that we released is an impact report uh, showing all the um, data over the last three years and the impact that the reach center has had on the community we served over 6100 households over the past three years uh, we've launched new programs like the tenant landlord resource office rent ready uh, workshops and collaborative teams such as a a collaborative team of agencies designed to help people connect with case management and housing on a walk-in basis. Um, the REACH Center has also helped smaller nonprofits get off the ground and we've designed new systems of care for community members.